Okay, so the last time I battled and recorded a Teluria tank, I took, you know, blues like a jackass. So now I'm going to be taking reds uh, and little Rygard over there. Hopefully two cleanses should help. Um, the problem is the Jabberwock and Alassie don't... You can't cleanse those. So I'm really only taking them for Gravemaker and for Teluria herself. Let's see if the board favors me. Not bad. Not the best. I don't know if this can kill her. She's not very emblem. She's not emblem very high, but that, no, it didn't. Um, I don't think there's anything that I can do at this moment that is going to stop her from going off. Because Rygard alone can't deal uh, that much damage. So I'm going to go ahead and have her go off. And clear that out of the way. So I need something. Give me a little something something. Okay, so... I don't think I'm going to win this match. Yeah. Because I, I have to set, and these two are going to go off. Yeah. So, that's two down. And I can't really kill anyone. I can't really heal anyone. So they're all within killing range of Gravemaker. Yeah. So preemptive strike, just flee. And then I'm going to rematch. Let's see if I can't try that again. And I'm coming to find, I know it's just a coincidence, but I can't help but feel like it's very intentional, the boards that I'm getting against her. Because these boards, y'all, I mean, they're, they're, they're not good. I mean, they could be worse, but these boards aren't good. And let's see, how much... Yeah, see, this is not going to kill her. Oh, I lied. Yes, it is. Someone posted something that... I'm not sure how true it is. They said once you uh, kill her, if she didn't go off, you're probably going to win. I have, I don't know, because I've killed her before. She went off before, and I still didn't win. Because right now, I, I absolutely have to have um, red tiles. And as you can plainly see, I'm not getting those. Like, they're just non-existent. And now the entire team is ready to go off. And I didn't even, like, really hit this side over here hardly at all. So I think it comes down to... Who's got what on them as far as um, emblems and troops? And as of right now, I'm stuck because I can clear a lot of bullshit out of the way. But in doing so, there's no way that I can do a cascade. If I move this one over to the uh, red area to move it over, that could start a cascade. But it would be a pointless cascade because they're all hitting a lassie whose defense is probably near 900. Yeah. So it's actually over 900. So that actually would not help me at all. Um, so who am I prepared to lose? I know I'm going to lose Rygard because of Jabberwock. Um, I'm most likely going to lose Zim and probably Kestrel. And then I'm going to be stuck with Marjana and Anzog, who probably won't last two turns afterwards. So I guess clear the bullshit and see if I can get what I need. Yeah, but it's not enough. As I knew it wouldn't be. So, um, yep. So the two that I thought I was going to lose, I lost. 
Uh, I didn't lose Zim, though. I uh, figured she'd go, but Fenrir went after someone else, as you saw. <sighs> I'm not in as bad of shape as I thought I would be. I need this to be comma diamond. Okay. Now I don't believe that I'm going to lose. See, what does that little rump bonus do? Did I, I don't think I saw anything. I have to see what he does. Because I didn't I honestly didn't see anything. It just said Rome bonus, but then nothing happened. All right, so that's Teleria in a nutshell. And I do agree to an extent that killing her before she goes off, it does up your chances of winning. However, when is that never the case for any tank? So with her, is it more prominent? I don't know. I have to, go, I have to do more uh, testing, but do I think she's a good tank? Yes, because the red options take against her aren't very they're they're not very good. If you don't have Grave Maker to take against Teluria, you're in some hot water. People say you can use uh Jean Francois. Yeah, you could if you had him. I do, but I don't have him maxed. And so how helpful would he have been in this situation? I personally don't think he would have been a better choice to take than a Max Kestrel, but I guess I should test him out once. In Kestrel's place. Uh, for some reason, the AI loves going after Kestrel and Red Hood both. That's why I, I seldom take them. Maybe I should try and see if the RNGs uh, numbers don't mind Jean-Francois. Uh, 